on. What the honk is wrong with us? Tama, can you do anything about this? Huh? Hey, Tama! Huh? She's not answering? Tama! Tama! Where are you? No way, dude. You don't think... Did we lose our powers? As keepers? Oh, come on. That's just... crazy. Any ideas? Any ideas? I don't see a gate. But we do have to get out of here. That's for sure. Oh, yeah. Still, without Tama, we might just die here. What? We're not gonna... <laughs> I don't know. No. I won't. The giants from the hills? Hmm? Are you okay? Oh! Yes, I'm fine. Thank you. I'm okay too. Talk about close calls. A little too close. I'm Squall. First. Uh, what's this? A box? Sort of. It's an eld box, a kind of artifact with some modern improvements. You might say it's kind of like those things that you keepers use to contain mirages. Huh? You mean prismariums? Aha. Uh -huh. Is that what you call them? Sure. You can just think of it like a prismarium. The only difference is that eld boxes are for capturing machines and not mirages. Capture them? Give it a try. <laughs> <laughs> you'd help us I'll tell you on the way but we need to go Me, I'm with Seed.
I know who you are. Quistus built me in. Quistus was... Oh! She gave us the fast craft! Oh! So she's in the League of S! The Lass and Glasses! <laughs> That's right. She's an officer, in fact. Wow! I didn't know she was a... So why are you here helping us out like this? I don't suppose it's too... Hmm? Sorry. But I don't think she ever mentioned a waterfall. It was Edgar, the guy who put you in here that asked me to help you out. What? That creep? Why? Yeah? In order to break loose of it, we'll need the Mako energy, which lies dormant beneath this facility. Are you sure that this Mako energy is that strong? Yeah, trust me. So wait, you mean... Yep, this isn't a coincidence. Edgar sent you here as part of the operation to perform a- Whoa, 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 whoa. So then why didn't he just ask us? Figaro didn't join the Federation willingly. It's under constant watch. Also, Edgar knew the Federation doesn't do- Dude, it's on. Let's make-
No trouble at all. Predictable. Apparently, the real thorns in their side are kept somewhere between. So, like, what's this job we're supposed to do? Our target, Maku Reactor Zero. It's swarming with all kinds of dangerous mirages. Oh, well that makes sense then. Right. We were hoping that you two would be able to keep the mirages at bay. Except, it looks like your powers have... Well, um, we don't really know. I mean, they've never been suppressed before. But they're useless now. Oops. So does that mean we, like, broke the master plan? If we have to do this without any keepers, then yes. The master plan is toast. <laughs> right, let's... But, the operation's in motion. Use the L-boxes, and we'll just have to hope for the best. Hmm? You know... The League of S has an agent on site. I think... It's possible, but I can't promise you. Now, enough talking. Let's press on.
predictable. Let's go. Come on, bring it.
This one looks a lot nastier than the others. Come on, be careful. Drawn enough thunder? Yeah, I'm good. The other agent is up ahead. I'll hold these clunkers off here. Go on without me. You can't take them all on. We'll stay. No, this is my job. Go! The... Wait! Come on. Are you serious? You can't help him. He'd only get in the way. Let's just do what he says. <sighs> all right. Chapter 15, The Mako Reactor and the Black Mages. That must be the agent up there. Wait, something's not right. Attacking us. Should I assume I've won? <sighs> Unless you fight back, you are going to die. If I look dead to you, then guess again! Mon! Hey! Are you alright? <sighs> Good. That's more like it. Countertech deployed. There is no method they can utilize that I can't neutralize. Wakey the wakey wakey! What? Huh? Tama! That's the me! Boy, am I ever the glad to see you! Dude! Finally! What a relief! We're all fixed! When I realized I couldn't though reach you, I was so the upset. If your powers have recovered, we need to keep going. Oh, isn't Shellcare the completely amazing? She's the with the, uh... Oh, if that's the right, the League of Us. Oh, I knew it. She is the other agent. So, are you done? Because we that need to keep... she did? I think that it's called Counter the Tech? Any the way, it can take any the kind of magic or technique, any or the move at all, and completely nullify it. Yes, that's right. Whoa, that's so cool. And that's the what she used to remove your suppressors. Although, she wasn't sure it the worked, 
So she was kind of the freaking me out. What? That that is not true at all. I was completely in control. If you control. ask me, she's a champion. Oh, how can you not to love her? Am I the right? You sure are. Thank you for the help. Yeah, you're the bestest. I, I don't have time for this. We are here to work. Let's continue the operation. Hello, Darren. Do you want me to send you a PlayStation voice chat? And then she had... What was it? There you go. She had Mr. Freeze. <laughs> oh, that's fine. Yes, this is you. Just way I this is my favorite right here. I just got them uh, a little bit ago on my last uh the last little bit of the stream. Okay, so that Good day, you know. Say look. I told you, Darren. If uh, if you end up having this game, I can. Uh, the second you un unlock the co Colosseum, which is like an hour and a half into the story, uh, I can just trade you all these guys. And you all have like the OP power team. But make sure you uh, download the 
when you buy this, make sure you download the maximum DLC, so that way you can get all the all the monsters. Oh yeah, a lot of people just didn't want to get into it because they're just like, this is, yeah, uh, that's the main reason why a lot of people didn't want to get into it. It's similar to Pokemon, but like there are certain ways, like the only way you can capture specific creatures is by doing the requirements for it. Right now, I'm about to go capture this son of a bitch. Nothing here. Nothing here. Okay, keep Ifrit out. Also, since I have your uh, character uh, on my stack, your character allows my my character to automatically regen. Do I have... Oh, god dang it. Wrong one. the warrior of light and what's this weakness wind to anything else, right? Resistant to water.
Yeah, this one also has like a special requirement for me to capture it. Erg. Okay, I think I'm gonna let my character die automatically. Cause it's not. I'm just gonna let my characters die at this point. Cause I think I have an idea. Just gotta go check at the Coliseum. Hurry up and kill everyone. Okay, yeah, party has fallen. Yes! Okay. Just took him back here. Good, good, good. I think one of these guys gives a f elixir. There it is. Expression. Let's begin.
I thought the confusion would have wore off at this point. Gonna go back here for a bit. Just gonna run around. Well, Darren, now you can say you're carrying me. All right. <laughs> So this will help uh, get a little bit more experience and the works too. Also, uh, so you know, Darren, I do have the battle music on random, so this isn't normally how it it's supposed to play for the battle music. Leave it on default for right now. Now, so you can hear it. Oh my god, I got hiccups. Uh, come on. Uh, as you progress through the games, you'll be able to unlock specific soundtracks. And. Towards the end of the. Uh, with this one specifically. Yeah. Maximum added a couple extras from 12, 13, and 14. So there's specific fight battle music that you'll find uh, that help you progress in the story. Like in a minute, I'll play one of my favorite battle musics that keeps me pumped. Except, I am told that with them adding two specific characters in here, which I don't want to spoil for later, um, one of their theme songs has been my favorite for a long time. Okay, so let me... Config. Alrighty, let's go. Come on. 
Those are my favorite. The Warrior of Light from the original Final Fantasy. Also, by me doing this, I'm also helping myself a little bit. Not only gaining experience on my guys, but also helping getting these guys leveled up as well. So in a minute, I'll check and see... Also, hold on, I gotta double check something, so gonna mute for a sec. Okay, now I fixed something. Now you're a mod, Darren. I was gonna do that the last time you were on the stream, but I completely spaced and forgot about it. You have power. But you know the the wise old saying with great power comes great responsibility. I'm still trying to figure out some nightbot commands, like I, I'm still trying to figure Nightbot out and all that. It's so confusing. That will help me for later, so I won't have to worry about that. And... Also, here's the other difference, Darren, from what you buy the normal game and you buy Maximum. Maximum allows you to change up your party if you capture a new uh, Mirage. And the other one, uh, in the regular version, you it just automatically goes to your box, which is a pain in the ass. So that's why I try to suggest to people, if they end up getting this game get the DLC for Maximum, or if they got a Switch, get the Switch version. Because the Switch automatically has that, uh, has that ability already unlocked in it. It's only an extra 15 bucks, um, to get on PlayStation, but it's worth it. Because... Maximum has a total of 30 plus hours of extra gameplay with all the new mirages, all the new cutscenes, 
and all the new seeker characters that you can run into over time. Okay, let's start looking at some of these things to level up. Yeah, this is what the cat turns into at the end. You missed it before where I uh, got uh, the Sphinx. Seed. Yeah, this is why I love this character. <laughs> Moomba Moomba inflicts neutral damage slash darkness, and it has a 10% to insta-kill. This move is broken. <laughs> like sweet Sebastian Bach, I've never seen a move that is this broken before. Oh, trust me, on my Switch version, I instantly got this character, and I was like, oh, well, I've played the, I played through this already, so why don't I just keep him on the main party? The second I get him to his second form and allows him to keep the moves that he has in his past version, he, he almost 100% insta-kills on my Switch version, which I still laugh at till this day. So I need to get some more because I'm still not at three. of the insecures. Do I have cure on him yet? No, I'm gonna add that next. Well, that ought to do it. Predictable. Oh, no, there's actually an easier fight. I can do to get experience. Gonna go run. I guess. Yeah, you see that little light that appears over your character the second uh, a fight starts. That's one of the skills I had to give it, which uh, which helps it do the auto heal.
Okay, I'm gonna go. I'm surprised I haven't done this earlier. My brain wasn't thinking at the moment. Every single time, my brain goes lagging. Just keeps lagging, 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 lagging. Well, it doesn't matter. It's gonna... It's the heal me the second I leave this area. And this is your little fast travel thing. Quest of them all. Hello, Goblin Queen. Oh, Our princess. <laughs> I'll get us through this. Uh, this looks like bad news.
Yes. Well, that ought to do it. And now I have unlocked the Princess Goblin. Leave, because she's okay, but geez, will be she's a pain in the ass. That was a lot of fun. Come back whenever you want to go another round. So long. And then you just run over here real quick. Then we can get the Goblin quests out of the way. Yeah, always make sure your, one of your characters has Libra on it. Did it. Oh, yeah. I'm just getting this quest over and done with because this is one of the easiest ones to do. Goblins. This won't take. That's great. No kid.
Don't let your guard down. Okay, okay. Make this good. Two.
Fuck. That wasn't so bad. Trouble at all. Good job. This won't take long. No kid go-
What now? Who's so... to the right, please? So, Riku, was it? Where might you be headed this fine day? <laughs> Do you really need to ask? Treasure Island! Ah. So the low seas have managed to keep a few secrets from me. It's full of treasure chests. Now that's what I call a paradise. The currents are so strong, I never could have made the trip all by my lonesome. It sure is a good thing I found you, Addy boy. You'd risk your life to reach this place? I wonder if treasure hunting is as fun as you say. It sure is. All those little treasures have been around way longer than I have. I'll be the first person to touch them in years upon years. Ooh, I can just squeal. Hmm, I see now. I had that same spark ages ago. Oh, I miss it. Yeah? Well, why don't you come along on this treasure hunt with me? I would, but I cannot survive outside the low seas. I envy you. Living life as you please. Now that is a true treasure. Hmm. If you say so. Oh! There's the island! I see it! Treasure chests! Hey, Addy! Thanks so much for the ride! No trouble at all. How will you get home? Look at all this stuff lying around here! There's gotta be some relic that'll help me! Oh, hey! Why don't you take something with you? I don't know what's in that chest there, but it's sure gonna be something good! I will help you. You do that? You're so sweet. Now, get that chest! These things really make you think twice about opening treasure chests. Yeah, I never the like jack-in-the-boxes. Yes, it sticks, but... Only way to know what we'll find is to okay. right in. Thanks for making it sound like we're dumpster diving. Very uplifting. This is it! Yeah! Predictable. Your job's full of surprises. <laughs> well, sometimes. Yeah. Despite the danger, you still mean to continue with it? Of course. It's in my blood. I live for treasure hunting. All my treasures need me. I can't stop now. <laughs> I see. Then I wish you a safe and fruitful journey. Mm. Thanks again, Addy. I'll see you real soon! Hunting treasure, eh? She did seem to be having fun. Perhaps my kin had been missing out. Perhaps it's time for an adventure of their own. I wonder... Would those Mirage Keepers help us?
No! No, 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 no! Why is every single chest I find a stupid mimic? Why are you treasures playing hard to get? Help me out here! <sighs> well, as long as there's one more chest to crack, I'm not gonna give up now. What happens to Treji imposters? Riku happens, and don't you forget it! <gasps> ah! Lightning! What? No way! In perfect weather like this? Don't tell me. There's a mama mimic? Oh, I see. So all these mimics infesting the island, that was your idea? You are doomed! I'm taking you out and ridding this island of all your little wannabes! That scared the me right out of my fur! How sinister! Who wouldn't open a treasure chest this big? It's like the mother load! It would be tempting. I guess this is what they mean when they say not to look a gift horse or chest. in the mouth. cheap shot there pulling out all those thunderbolts like that i thought i was a goner for sure but at least now i can finally huh what ah! what happened to all of the treasures no way yep it's riku <laughs> well at least with the mimics out of the picture i know every chest i open is the real deal I'm not gonna let one little setback set me back. And if you're out there, uh, I think here. so. Okay. I think all the, the voice actors came fall. back for Ooh. most of their roles.
tell me what. Good fight. Back at you. Well, it's like, hmm. Oh, I know. Didn't you used to call it a part-time job? This is not the same as flipping burgers at some fast food joint. Hey, it is what it is. So, I hope that you're ready to go through us. <laughs> if you think you can. I feel so bad I never got a chance to meet her back in Michigan when she was there for one of the conventions a long time back. It pissed me off so much. That's one. Oh, come on, don't be that way, you stupid tease. Oh, yeah. Both in. That's two down. Off the bat. Don't gotta worry about these two anymore. Well, Ifrit, you're staying in the box because I got a better version of you in my party right now. Same with you, Shiva. <laughs> See ya! Go back in the box! I love how, like, now it's like, oh, you can now go fight them individually. It's like, nope.
I think I can still do this. Dang it! Yeah. Two seconds short. That wasn't so bad. Oh. All right. Yeah, I'm just gonna do one more. Oh, for Pete's sake, you gay. Hey guys, why is it Ramu here with you? Whoa, hey, don't go saying Ramu's name out loud like that. Seriously, the old man is all eyes and ears. What kind of hot water are you twerps trying to get us in? And you, what were you thinking saying Ramu? I heard that you two. Tell me, why would you sneak away? What possessed you? Oh. Uh, well, you know, we were, uh, sort of bored out of our wits. No, look! We were giving Lon and Rain some help with their training. Oh, nice. That is right. We're only thinking of them. You numbskulls. There's a reason we must stay in the nebula, and you know what it is. Uh, we're not dumb. The Tri-Elements Barrier, right? We have to maintain it. Come on. It's just one excursion. Dunderheads! Already your little excursion has led to two casualties. What? Don't tell me someone got out! Do you know who it is that escaped? An Ifrit and a Shiva. In both cases, you might say they were your unfair of sex. Right. Just had to be her. He's on the loose? Oh no. Yes, now I get my favorite. Hey, you said casualties. You don't mean people. Yeah, they have to be. When no one summons us, we have to enter this world the old-fashioned way. It's simple, really. In lieu of an elaborate summoning ritual, we can just use the magic in a human body as our gate. And as for the poor human, well, it's kind of messy. What? Full metal alchemist! Therefore, the old queen came to us and asked we place a barrier along the world's fringe. And because these two decided to goof off, now people have been hurt. Uh, look, we made a big mistake. A colossal mistake, you clods. <sighs> so, to sum it up, Another Ifrit and Shiva are on the loose and wreaking havoc here in Grumor, right? Mm. They may have been waiting for just this chance. If they know our Ifrit and Shiva and how responsible they always are. Well, they're just two mirages. Me and Rain can handle them. We'll find them and teach them a good lesson. That's right. You three return to the nebula. Take care of that barrier. Very well. In that case... We will leave images of ourselves here in this place, so you may continue to train with us as before, unless you object. Uh, no! 
You took the words right out of my mouth. Okay. Lawn, rain, see you. Boy. Big goblins. I certainly are a handful. A female Ifrit and a male Shiva, right? And just when we thought we'd run out of mirages to collect. Where is he at? There he is. There. Well, that ought to do it. Victory. The okay. So when you uh, get the game, it'll tell you like when you use Libra, it'll tell you what specific moves help you get the. Prismariums open so you can capture these creatures. For Ifrit, Shiva, and Ramon, it's fire, uh, fire, ice, and lightning. And I've known that since day one for those guys. Large amount of fire attacks. And now we got two other mirages now loose in the area. Which normally is a bad thing, but I think I'm at high enough level to where I can fight them. Yes, um, if you use a specific type of attack multiple times, or if you have something that deals a stronger amount, uh, uh, like how I was using the items. When you use a small thunder attack, a medium thunder attack, and a large thunder attack, it helps speed up the process to catch it faster. Like I said, Darren, I think you would like this game, especially if, uh, if you end up having this on the Switch, or if you have a Switch, I forgot if you told me if you did or didn't, uh, I can literally tra trade you all the Prismariums that I've caught, because literally all I have to do is talk to this little guy right here on my Switch, 
and then we can trade or if you end up getting this for PlayStation all I gotta do is talk to this little guy and do multiplayer transfer of prismariums okay so travel Let's save real fast. Whew, okay. Oh wait, I should probably check and see if they're here first. If the quests are here, then it's gonna make this so much more fun. Because I wanna unlock both of them right away. Please, 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 please say you're already unlocked. Damn. Okay. Okay, that's probably not going to be for a little bit longer. Because I love uh, the female Ifrit uh, story. It's funny as all hell. Like she has so much sass, but she acts exactly like how the male one does. Let's hurry up and go backwards. Darren, do you have a switch?
Good job. Make this good. Dude, it's on. Oops.
Now that's how you do it. Okay. Now let's continue on with the story, shall we? But first, I need to get me something to drink. Be right back.
Okay, now back to what we were doing. Watch your step here. This area is full of mirages. Hey, we got this. Oh yeah, this right here is our time to shine. Right, let's do this!
Trouble at all. Good job.
Okay, Darren, I'll see you later, buddy. You have a great night, all right? Gonna invite Paul into the chat real fast. Okay, here we go. I won't hold back.
Yeah, we got this. I guess we're doing this. There's something strange about these mirages. I think some of them are unimprisonable, unless you use Eldbox. Say that again? You mean they're machines, not mirages? So bad. Yes. 
something then, Josh. How's it going, Paul? No, bad, dude. Yeah. I'm okay. Um, better than I was uh, during that stream. Yeah, I don't know why they didn't get you in. Well, I even talked to. Sorry, putting my bag of chips away. Um, like I even talked to Rando and them, and Rando uh, was like, "Yeah, Paul and uh, Sarah are good players, but yeah, you're part of the group too, so I don't understand what happened." And I'm like, "I really don't know either." So I was just like, I'm not gonna press it anymore. If I can join, I can join. If not, that's just how it is. Well, at least we know how to imprison them. For now. So. And then I was also talking to Rando. He was like, well, there was also a talk about... Um... If I'm actually dedicating myself to play these games and I'm like, well, yeah, but I'm not playing just those games whenever I stream and all that. that was a good Victory. It's like right now I'm doing a let's play of one of my other games right now. Mm. It's like, he's like, well, how many games well, do you have going on your let's play? And I was like, right now yeah. it's at six. I have six different games on which I've been trying to get Let's Play started. I finished three of them recently. I got this one and one other left. And also, I wasn't like how Mike was when he was playing Anthem, where he like plowed through the story mode just so he can get that Grandmaster thing unlock. I was enjoying the story, so I was taking my time. Hmm. And also, whenever I play with my brother or something, he wants to play it on normal mode, so I'm not gonna try to push him into uh, into trying to go at a harder difficulty. If he wants to play it his way, he plays it his way, and I'm I respect that. Yeah. So, because Mike brought up a point about how I haven't had any Masterworks lately. I'm like, well, yeah, because I'm not trying to get it that way. I'm trying to enjoy the game for what it is. Mm -hmm. So, like, I, I don't know what else to say about it, but... Like, even Bay and them... We're wondering if I was okay. That wasn't so bad. So, it was just like, they were worried about me. They thought I was going to do something stupid that night because, like, when everyone else left the voice chat, I ended up bursting into tears because that really was like a giant punch in the gut for me. Yeah, I... Because apparently it was all fist and front and everything. Yeah. I don't know what Chris had planned and I think it was just Chris who for forgotten about you. I won't hold back. Well, that's right. what I'm saying. Bea and, um, Bea and Katie were trying to remind him and saying, Hey, you're forgetting about someone. It's kind of messed up. That's why I did say quite a few things when I saw you. And I was like, streaming, it's like, yeah, Josh, so uh, are you coming? Uh, just trying to get Chris to remember. Well, the problem yeah, was, like, was Mike, because that also pissed me off when Mike instantly was just like, oh, wait, Lugo's on. Let's invite Lugo instead of, wait, I'm sitting out here waiting for an invite. Yeah. Like, what the fuck, Mike? I know, exactly. So, I think... Chris and Mike forget shit at times. Well, Chris, Chris forgets every now and again if you don't tell him 
like beforehand, like before like the madness ensues. And also, it didn't help that Mike had that freaking bounty on his head, and for 35 minutes you were in that chaos situation. Yeah. Because literally, that's that was the whole that was the whole problem on why we couldn't get into like no one trying to get a hold of Mike and them, because they're trying to figure out how the hell to get this bounty shit off. Yeah, I say to him, go to the four stop, pay it off. Yeah, I know you were screaming to pay it off. Sarah was screaming to pay it off, and. Uh, Mike's like, no, no, I'll bring more fun to the thing. It's like, you can't do anything if you have a bounty. Exactly. That was a good fight. Victory! See, I like my Chris I get on better with Chris than I do Mike. Yeah. And I've, I've been cool. noticing that a lot lately, is that I'm having more fun playing with, like, Chris and them on my days off than I do Mike now, because Mike is acting weird lately. I understand he had a whole bunch of stuff going on with all the different audition gigs and all that. But, like, something else is, like, making him act weird lately, and I'm not the only one who thinks so. Hmm. See, so the thing is, I've actually spent quite a bit more time me, me speaking with Chris. Uh -huh. Actually, me and Chris spoke for about an hour alone one night about chefing. Because mm. Chris has a passion for it as well. Yeah. And obviously, it is my what I do as a job. Yeah. I mean, Chris actually, that ought to do it. Chris is talking about loads of food. Like yeah. Japanese curries, Thai curries, and all that. I mean, me and Mike. Chris were talking about one day with Mike there, and Mike's like, oh, I like India, and me and Chris turned around and went, yeah, well, that's just crap. <laughs> yeah, like, both, um, I think we've had this conversation before, both my parents are cooks. And, mm. and I, I, I'm not, like, a full-blown chef in the household. I cook whatever I cook, and I cook it the way I cook it. Um... But, um, I do have some passion for learning about different, how to make specific meals. Like, Hopefully, it's crazy. Stream, Mike said something about, we made, Chris made a joke about haggis, and Chris, Mike turned around and goes, oh, I've never heard of what's like, and I'm like, well, Mike, it depends on the way you cook it, it's how it tastes. And I was explaining different methods, and he's like, oh, no, 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 I don't even know how to cook it. I'm like, Mike, you need to understand, there are so many different ways to cook it. That you need to understand the different texture to actually get the quality of taste. Mm. And Chris was trying to explain to me that like you need to listen so you can actually hear. Yeah. Hell, the the one thing with me, I'm more of a visual rather than taught. You know what I mean? It's easier for me to see how it's done than to hear how it's done. We're doing this. Or if I have it like written down for me, I can do it that way too. But for some odd reason, when someone's explaining how to do it, it's hard for me for some weird reason. And I think it's because of my learning disability. Yeah. Like my no aunt, trouble. my aunt's always said like, she's like, you have such a talent for cooking, but you can't do the things unless it's like you you're shown it or if or if it's done this way and I'm like I'm sorry and she's like there's no need to be sorry that's how some people's brains work and that's the thing it's like some people just don't know how to do it do you know I'm playing Call of Duty Modern Warfare right now mm -hmm. and there's a, there's a online mode called Prop Hide right now mm -hmm. I'm disguised as an oil can and I'm just hiding amongst the rest of them. <laughs> Still not being spotted or shot. That's actually probably the best disguise ever. Just hiding there. <laughs> yeah. Oh, you can change props? Ah, oh, cool. 
Yeah, right now I'm just doing my uh, World of Final Fantasy thing. Right now, I'm having fun. I and mean, I, I feel so bad right now, Paul, because this whole time, I haven't realized I was not playing it right. You know what? I'm the only one alive. The only prop left alive. And they still haven't found me. <laughs> And they're shooting around everything, they're blowing everything up, and I'm just like, hee hee! Yeah, I'm caught in me. <gasps> oh, yes, I got that ability now! Yes! One! Booyah! I win! Nice. They probably look at the final, like the last score, and then just like that. Fuck, can you see him there? Yeah. You know, I got a little mini bottle of whiskey for Christmas. I just. And it's JD, so bourbon. I hate uh -huh. Jack Daniels. Uh -huh. I've just tried it with lemonade, and it's not actually bad with lemonade. Interesting. I don't know if you were able to tell on Wednesday stream, but I was getting drunk. <laughs> uh, to be honest, after Mike did that whole thing, I popped in the few times to go say hi to you, hi to uh, uh, Rando, and hi to Chris. And you know, you're not popping to David. <laughs> oh, I was popping. I was talking to David for a bit, you know, and even he, he thought it was messed guy. up. Yeah, David is such a nice guy, I actually like him a lot. Oh yeah, the first conversation I had with David, and this was a while back, um, this was before he uh, even got Red Dead, um, Chris brought him into the voice chat, and he's like, hey, I'm gonna bring David in, and I was like, David, David who? He's like, David Fielding. I'm like, no! I'm like, he has PlayStation 2? And then, like, we yeah. got into this whole discussion about all these different, uh, uh, comics, uh, and all this stuff that didn't even involve Power Rangers. We didn't even talk about Power Rangers once, the first conversation we had. And a lot of people yeah. are like, isn't that the first question you should be asking him? I'm like, no, because that's a question he's probably been asked a half a dozen times, and he's probably sick and goddamn tired of it. Do you know what? I owe David a lot. I still need to thank him for it. Let's see, like two years ago, I was going on first ever show I had done for about seven, eight years, about mm -hmm. seven years, yeah. Mm -hmm. And I was nervous, and I had David on Snapchat, and I asked him for advice, and he gave me the best advice for it in my first show. And uh -huh. to this day, I thank him for it. Well, that's cool, man. I need to actually. When he's next on my old sending voice chat, just say, look, there you are, I'm gonna ask you this. Never got a chance years ago, but the advice you gave me for my skill and how to keep calm and yeah. prepping for the audition, I want to thank you for it. So I know he's, he suffers from depression. That wasn't so bad. You know, you told me when I was a kid that one day I'd be playing games with Power Rangers. I wouldn't believe you. Oh yeah, trust me, I, that's the exact same sentence I say to myself. That, how can I... How can I have friends with different Power Rangers and all these other people? Like, how? How in the hell did I manage to get to this part of my life yeah. when... Not only do I have friends with Power Rangers, I have friends with different voice actors. I have, I've made friends that have family members with different celebrities, and we don't even talk about it. Like Andy and uh, Janelle, do the fact that Andy's dad is is Bruce fucking Campbell. Like me and Andy met through Hyper. Same with Mike, and also. Uh, we also played a couple games together, and I also loved watching his streams, too. Never in our, in, in our friendship have I ever brought up his dad one time. 
and he said uh it, this is something that's stuck in my head forever and andy if you watch this later on yes i'm gonna get sappy on me right now but sh shut up and you can understand it he said this is the first time in over five years when someone has had hour-long conversations with me without having to say so what is your dad doing or something like that you know i when i first started speaking with chris obviously i did ask him what was it like working on the show and i was like be as brutal as you want and the second i said oh you started i think you realized i can say whatever the fuck i want with this guy and he's not going to take offense yeah because he was he said a Scottish insult and I just turned around and went, I want you to. And straight away he just started laughing. Yeah, you got I guess we're doing this. Well, that's me. You can insult. The only thing I've, I've been triggered before, don't get me wrong. I've been triggered with insult. It's like Chris on Wednesday. I was like, oh Chris, the best ever freaking holiday. Oh, uh, hey. for them. Jewish all day just for getting pissed and he's like, wait, 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 you're Scottish and Jewish? When the <laughs> fuck did they start making them? <laughs> ah, shit. But that was correct and I was just like... <laughs> yeah. I was saying something when I was screwing Aberdeen last week, I was like, Dude, I'm actually playing with Chris for Kane and me on PlayStation. He's like, what? I'm like, you know Andros? And he's like, no. I was like, yeah. And David Palin, Zardoni, he's like, dude, how the fuck are you getting this? I'm like, to be fair, I only started playing with Chris due to with Mike. Yeah. If it wasn't if it wasn't for Chris, to be honest with you, if it wasn't for Chris, I wouldn't be streaming right now. Because he was, he, he gave me the motivational speech because I told him about how the one thing I've always hated in the old days back when I used to record with my friend Jeanette, Sam, all of them, and we used to play games and stuff, was I was being made fun of, of my stutter or being made fun of my, my, because sometimes my brain, when I try to hide the fact I'm in pain, I go to it doing funny voices and all that stuff and people were just saying oh he's one of those guys it's not a mr serious guy it's like well i am it's just the problem is is my body just can't do it no trouble at all. Yeah. because of the physical and emotional trauma that i have endured over the 20 some odd years i've lived and chris was like this he's like josh you know what in all honesty, I've never seen someone as kind-hearted and as light-hearted as you. And that hit me so much right in the chest, right there. There, when the red space rings, I told you that. Yeah. Chicken! Make <laughs> someone for... Uh, what do you call it? Say it up. <laughs> I think we've gotten lucky. How many people can say they play games with childhood heroes? Not that many. So speaking to a random guy in the bus, I do not know. So he, he mentioned Power Ranger, I went, oh yeah, I play it with you. And he's like, what? And I was like, oh yeah, yeah, I play with uh, Christopher Kim and Leah play Angros. And he's like, oh cool, I only played the game with JDA. I was like, for half an hour. And he couldn't really talk because he had his kids there and I was like, Yeah, I actually sit a chat in with Chris and Mike yeah. and Lord on for like that hours on so end. Yeah. Chris, I'm literally shooting everything here because it might be a potential target. Yeah, I think it's funny how they actually, the Modern Warfare actually brought the prop hunt thing into effect on that one. Mm -hmm. I was like, oh, come on. That's too funny. That is way too funny. It's annoying. 
it's annoying, but like it's a funny aspect that they brought Prop Hunt onto that game specifically. Yeah, the best Call of Duty game by far is Call of Duty, Call of Duty World at War. Oh, there's a drop around this area. I heard you whistling, yeah, when you fall back. Looks like a major problem. Get it, major. A waterfall was hilarious on Wednesday because I knew I was getting drunk a lot. Shit, I ain't gonna be able to control my accent that much. Do you so think they're malicious? Control it a wee bit. But nah, as I was getting drunk, Mike's like, you can control it? Like, oh, oh, yes, Mike, I can. I was just saying I all the time, if I want to. Yeah. I'm saying, yeah. Yes, Mike. Uh, sure. I. Okay, yeah, no, you need it. But there's me up there. Mate, I think again, like, ah, oh, yeah, I know. Sits you down. Mike, for fuck's sake. Fucking hell. <laughs> but Chris burst into laughter when I was telling him, I told the waitress to tell the customer to fuck off. Mm. Because they said their steak was too tough when they ordered a well done steak. Okay, I'm pretty sure the satellite dish ball is not a fucking frog. But what, one thing I do love is the fact that Chris wants to get drunk with each other. <laughs> yeah. If he comes to Scotland. Now I just got one of my favorite characters brought back to the game. I got BB back. So she can. That is odd. <laughs> you just noticed? So, kid, your name is BB? Mm -hmm. So your friends there. Are all of them able to talk just like you do? Friends? Where? Hey! Don't you the line? Line? They are? Well, fact, didn't hey, you no better one. than to act mean. Oh. <laughs> nice. See? I knew they'd be reasonable. They even said they'll help us. Wow. me impressed. Yes, bravo. Okay, <laughs> so what can me and my friends do for you? Oh, actually... God, I love this game so much. Yeah, I realized I fucked up Paul and didn't uh, transfer my data to the DLC of this game. And the DLC is basically the update patch for the new game uh, version of this Final Fantasy World game. And I was like, ah, oh, crap. And so, so far I've missed a total of, I think, four, maybe five different mirages that I couldn't capture right now because I was playing the original version, not maximum version. Oh, well, it looks like I'm getting a second job. Why? Um, I'm trying to get money so I can move down to Aberdeen. It's mm -hmm. not exactly easy when you're working a crap job. Yeah. Three bedrooms for three hundred, like four hundred and ninety pounds a month. Jeez. 
Here, spare the mom thing. My little flat is one bedroom, my last flat, like 450 pounds. For three bedrooms, for an extra 40 quid, hell yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah, Pop. By the way, couldn't this be that cradle of Mako's light that has the key of Earth? This key here? Huh? Dude, it's the second key. Ask and you shall receive it. It appears that Vivi had it all along. Lucky we are. Again, it all seems just a little too lucky. But there's no point in dwelling on it right now. Is this officially ours? So, Vivi, where will you go now? Hmm. How's this? Stay in Figaro. Huh? Hey, it's you! Oh, my favorite giants. Your help has been most invaluable. Uh, 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 didn't Squall relay my intentions? Yes. Well, listen, I... I am sorry. The Federation is watching me like a hawk, so I... <laughs> What about Lightning? Is she okay? Oh, yes. I made certain she escaped. After all, she wouldn't have been out there protecting me had I asked. Huh? Seriously? She was part of this? Oh, then mm. technically you oh, did help us before into a lobby you unhelped us. Yeah, I guess. An Irishman. Even now? A Belgian. Yes, so? Yeah. Russian. Dutch. Yeah. Polish. Of course, I you can watch. Oh, hey, two other favorite child killer. Uh, who was that? Where did it come from? Has it always been there? Lurking beneath Figaro? Incredible. That mirage that possessed power beyond the belief. Hmm. Dun dun dun. After all that I've put you through, this hardly suffices. But I have some information. Huh? One of the keys is in the land of Next the Ultra Knight. Really? Next track is Australia. Where you where? Hey, oh, really? Yeah. Where is it? To the west of here, you'll find Big Bridge. Next. Colossal Crossing will take you to another continent. That particular continent gets no sunlight due to the thick, dark skies overhead. They even call it the land of the stolen sun. Really? How can place not be not at night? Be in the L4 for dinner, so let me go see what the situation is. I'll be right back, Paul.
Kings Parcel is Lords in Germany One shot, so I don't need to change me. Okay. <laughs> oh shit, screwed up going to my mom, but I'll just keep the power down. Okay, so if you're wondering, yes, I've got a black helmet just to show my respect for this weekend alone on chart this week for Charlie White and Formula One race suit and director who sadly passed away at age 66. It's breaking hard. Oh, bugger. Didn't get stopped in time there. That was just a bit of a clusterfuck. Can you change the that's my great class. Ah, oh, fuck you, game. It's me, cut, 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 cut. I just took the wrong bloody line. Oh shit, 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 shit. Intel wall. Not many people like going into the whole thing of. As soon as you get thrown in these tires, they're a bitch. Okay, so I'm starting from T6 on the grid. Most likely I won't have to do a formation map. So I've got McLaren on my left, Williams behind me, and the Red Bull and another Williams. Okay. Turn the fuel to lean, ERS off. Perfect launch. Oh, bit of tire squeal. Turn the fuel ERS back up to Rich. Oh, come on, Hass. What the fuck are you doing, you ass? Okay, I'm very heavy in turn two. Here we go, keep it on the outside of that guy. Have a lift slightly. Switch it to the overtake mode so I can get. Fast as make sure I that turn. Okay, on the slipstream off the half. Ooh, I had to take avoid an action there. Nearly went right up the trumpet of a half and a tall Russell. Would not be nice. And I got a warning for bumping wheels with somebody. Else. Fuck you, game. Uh, so my dinner for tonight.
is yellow homemade yellow rice and corn and some venison venison nice yellow rice Yellow well, the way the way, the way my Tom grandma King. the way my grandma makes it, she she adds her own uh, spices and all that to the yellow rice. As long, see now, how does the venison cook? I have no idea. My stepdad makes it, but he makes it way too like like the right. the meat isn't loose. It's like very tight. Nah, no, 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 venison should be nice and gamey. Like, the way my That's dad right. makes it, it's very, like, loose and it's kind of like a steak, so sort of, for me. That's how it should be. Nice and tender. But whenever my stuff that cooks it, it's too, like, I feel like I'm, like, going like a, a dog and just going... Like, the, the way I cook my venison, I cook it in red wine. Mm -hmm. If I'm cooking it in a kitchen, like restaurant-wise, then I can't really do it that great. It's the method I want. Mm -hmm. But personally, I would soak it venison in red wine for 24 hours. Nice. That's what I do. With a bit of... Uh, what is that star freaking herb coat again? I know his name. With a bit of... Uh, Jet as well. Paul, do you have Facebook? Yep. You should add me on Facebook. I only boom squad from the yeah. page thing with Bobby. Yeah, Josh Torres. Shut up, Jeff. <laughs> Because, to be honest with you, Paul, I would love for you to, like, see your recipes and, like, try to do it myself. Unfortunately, the job I'm in at the moment, I'm stuck to a freaking chain restaurant company that sort of met methods. Mm. But that sucks. If I, move to, <laughs> if I move to Aberdeen, I've got a care home job that wants me. Mm -hmm. I had an interview with him last week, and the guy said to me, oh, I love your food, it's just gorgeous. Just we're stronger. What he wanted from me was a random dish. He just gave, didn't tell me what to make, he just wanted me to make it out of pretty much thin air. So what I did was grab, he gave me chicken, and he's like, right, that's your protein, make or off it what you want. My first yeah. instinct was a uh, hunt of chicken, which is chicken covered in bacon, barbecue sauce, and cheese. You'd probably call it like a smuggled chicken or something of a mistake. But, because they didn't have bacon, I thought, right, that, that one's out of the I know. They've got aragon over there. They got cream. Mm-hmm. So all together, and he was extremely impressed with it. So got, and I put back that squash on with mash. And I personally, I, would have, I wish I chose rice over the mash. But, if you get home, rice is not exactly the best thing for elderly people. Quite right. choking out of it. <laughs> Unfortunately, you told me I'm great and all that stuff. Great potential, great amazing chef. Ouch, I crashed. <laughs> yeah. Oh yeah, Mo keeps his name regardless. I keep forgetting about that. Well done. We did it. Right now, I'm just trying to do some uh, Let's be arena quest. 
and World of Final Fantasy to see if I can start unlocking a specific character. Because if I can unlock this one specific character, then I am pretty much golden for the rest of this playthrough. Nice. Speaking with some random girl from Tinder over Snap that night, I sent her uh -huh. a strange, like a picture of one of the dishes of food, and she went, Ooh, fancy, you'd be sad to hear that my extremely fussy ear. Like, why can't. Oh. oh, lost ball. Okay. Okay, you still there, Paul? There. there we go. Yeah, I'm still here. For some odd reason, like the the chat just like insta died. Uh. I'm surprised my stream didn't crash because it said network error, and I was like, no, not again. No, it's usually a flip when it says network error. It's usually freaking voice chat. I actually get that problem quite a lot when I'm with Mike. Do it. Ah, here we go. Interlagos. Interlagos means between the lake. Oh. Good job. It's the only fact I know about the track. Uh, other than that, I also know the fact that Ayrton Senna won here in 1990. Oh shit, 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 that will not do Senna proud. Uh, one here in 91, the most unblock win that he ever won that he was the most happiest with that he actually collapsed at the end of the race. But he physically was drained that badly because his car was stuck in sixth gear. 
and he still won the race with a 20 second gap. <sighs> and if any Lewis Hamilton fans freaking pop up on the stream after this, yeah, your little bitch oh, oh. fan, well, uh, friend Hamilton, couldn't he do a single thing that Ayrton Senna could? To me, the best F1 drivers in the history of the sport go in this order. Jim Clark, Ayrton Senna, Michael Schumacher. Begin. Principally for the fact that Jim Clark, not only for the fact that he is Scottish, but due to the Watch fact it. that he be a tough one. No would race in so many different categories. In one year alone, Jim Clark won the Australian and New Zealand race season, F2 in Britain and F2 in France. He also raced in Indianapolis, the Indy 500 and won that, and the Formula 1 Championship, and the British Touring Cars Championship in one season. Huh. And that was back in 1966, or the 60s. That's why he's my number one driver. But the driver everybody calls the best, Ayrton Senna, says Jim Clark is the best, before his death, says Jim Clark was the best. So you got one of the best drivers in the world, who everybody idolises and says is best, but that driver himself always said another driver is better than him. I didn't know that. I'm a, I think can't tell by our best one. Oh, oh, <laughs> Through the center S's, there's no contact, ah, and somebody like, just smacked my fucking rear. Okay, your yeah, right on to hot that. Let's break. Oh, dude, come on, don't use my car as a fucking breaking point. Shut up, Jeff. Wow. Car across the side. Shut up, Jeff. Oops, sorry dude. I lost my back end and I broke your front wing. Sorry, my bad. Okay, I should really come off that one. It's not working for me tonight. <laughs> yeah, once I get all these... Mementos. Right, I'll be back. back in a sec. Alright. Well done.
Well, if you want to do uh, some anthem after I finish this uh, this side mission, I'm game for it. Wait, I'm not. Doggles on Red Dead right now. You can join her. I'm about to say, uh, I think since I dropped out of the call, you could probably invite her to voice chat, and probably the three of us could do Red Dead. Because right now I kind of can't, because uh, I'm in the middle of a battle right now, so I can't uh, send a send a thing. I like Sarah as well. She's that quite nice girl. Yeah. <laughs> There we go, Jesus Christ. Well done. No trouble at all. Time for me to get my medication out. I may not be able to talk like at all on Monday. Hi, Hi Sarah. Sarah. Hi. Charlie, say hello. Hi. Right, you remember that friend that I was screaming at? No, I'm sorry. Like, yes. Was... The one that I thought like tied you up in like a closet or something like yes, that. The one yeah. That you told to tie me up and put me in a closet. Yes. Oh, don't, Charlie. Don't talk any. Charlie, it's not kinky. Kinky. Uh. <laughs> oh, I died. Are you surprised? Yeah. <laughs> I don't know how many dead people Okay, Shaylee, we do not. I'm bad at this game, okay? Okay, how many shoes are being bought for this? If I'm hearing dead corpses. How many Okay, I'm not buying any shoes. Uh huh. But. <laughs> My friends are so confused. Get yeah, some new awesome boots, yeah. New, new hats. You've got to let your friends die to get boots. That's how it goes. Multiple times. Multiple Kira, times, yes. why are you trying to kill a pen, you silly cat? <laughs> oh. I tried yeah. to steal something of yours, but there was nothing to grab, so I just went for your drink. <laughs> <laughs> Way to go, sir. I, I don't know. <laughs> I have to change my loadout back because Shaylee is a. What would what do you call it, sir? A snipper? A snippy. Instead of a sniper, she's a snipper. Or a snippy. Or whatever. Something. Kira. Come back soon. Okay, so those fights are now done. Let's save. Yeah, me and Paul were thinking after, well, after I'm done with my match, uh, we can all do some Red Dead. Yeah, sure. We'll do some Red Dead. Shay, are you happy to just sit there? Yeah. You're just, okay, this is why good friends are just sitting and to play Red Dead. I steal that. <laughs> Wait, what the fuck was that? Oh, you're watching a stream. Oh, okay. I was so confused. I just hear voices. I don't hear voices. That sounds weird. Okay. Hello. Well, that, you, you said that the last time where you heard voices. I didn't mean it like... I'm... Ah, Shaylee, I'm gonna scream! <laughs> hearing yourself. I don't like hearing the delay. I don't like hearing myself. You're so... Shaylee, I'm gonna like literally throw your phone across the room. 
I think you die. don't rewatch Mike's streams then. No, I think Mike's they're watching my stream on it. I just don't watch the stream sometimes. Maybe. You have awakened as a Haley, champion, I swear to God. I believe you have washed your hands grab a pair of fucking headphones. However, <laughs> I am mine, grab them. I'm trying to figure out what to, uh, Final Fantasy Monsters to name after you two. Oh, you I just got blown away. Love that. There's dog, Shaylee, there's, there's dog hair everywhere. I know it's just words. Shave my dog. I've heard enough about what the Federation's done. You do. Understand that it's not right. <laughs> oh, maybe I can help you. I love how Vivi's voice actor is like a child. <laughs> Eloquently stated. Yes. No one to you soon. I think they'll start with letting the dog. King Anchor, why? You've ordered the black mages on yet another mission? Yes. With them out in the field, your men can so stay here and get some much needed rest. You have the tree in your cells. You're refusing to see the problem at all. I'm alright, I'm seeing uh, Captain, you, Captain, Captain Miss Marvel. You are Marvel. far too trusting yeah, again. Miss Marvel, the Captain Marvel. Captain Marvel. And for all we yeah, know, they're still spying on us. I I'll just have to keep an eye on them for the both yeah. of us. I beg of you. Shai, why don't you put a The movie was okay in my mind. Why don't you put a marker to the general store? Oh, okay. I was letting my friend Shaylee play the game, and that's why I'm really confused. Shaylee's been on many streams. Why is it every time after I've joined the played Micro Chris, my honor level seems to be less, at least less than what it started off with? <laughs> oh, I have 27 cents. It's not my fault, right. Shailene! Okay, I bought a really ugly like, hairstyle for my character because I thought I was going to a prom with a few friends at an event. Uh, we couldn't get it, so I wasted my money and now I have 27 cents. In zero, like, actual sense. It is. Shaylee, this is too much for my brain. you just can't help but like It's Inception for Sarah. Yes, yeah, Sarah's not very smart. You gotta remember, Sarah just knows red dead terms. Sarah's failing school, remember? Force Nay. Love that. We also need you to get started on Anthem too. That too. Yeah, I will. <laughs> Okay, Shaylee, Shaylee, See, I'm thinking my interest, the only reason I bought Anthem is because Mike's like that, you should get it, you should get it, it's like, okay, I'll buy it. I love Bioware games, that's the reason why I got it. I love Bioware games. Like, perfect example, a lot of people hate Mass Effect 3, I thought it was okay. I don't know, that thing's quite kinky, like. It died because he couldn't get those shoes in time. Yeah, yeah. Get my shoes in time, definitely. King Edgar, why? 
You've ordered the Black Mages on yet another mission? Yes. Uh, considering the operation at hand, I felt that their ranged magic would be the best fit. I understand your reservations, but you need to learn to trust Vivi and the I got very confused when I just saw like an invitation for the party. I was like, how can you foist all the hardest missions on them? Just if anything were to happen to the Black Mages, oh my lord, excuse you, Shaylee. I heard that too. You heard that? You were heard. Yep. <laughs> you just I can barely hear because I'm focusing on the cutscene that I'm in right now. Don't focus on anything. What is going on? Let it all fade away. The black mages are ready to leave at any time. Hmm. You're a sly one, baby. Huh? Oh. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Listen up. Hell Today, yeah. The castle guard will be deploying with you. Don't let them down. I knew that I was right to place my trust in them. The black mages, Figaro. Who joined a race? Friends. Who have I joined? Me. I joined someone. Still, you? Okay. Did Vivi win the captain over? I got very. <laughs> my controller just vibrated and scared me. You're gonna, you're you're gonna stream and then there's gonna be echo upon echo upon echo upon echo upon echo. Okay. Stop chatting with girls on Tinder, on Tinder ball. Concentrate in the race. It's me. I'm dying. You dying? I'm trying. I'm dying. Oh, that was a collision. Yes, it was the best thing, especially for a funny furniture. It's brilliant. Oop, that's a heist. Don't run into that shit. <laughs> Especially when I give him Mr. Speedy Boy. No one knows what they're doing on Speedy Boy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hurry! Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Makes me angry. When, like, low level people in this game, trash. No bell buckle, trash. How did I get to a level 100 until... I don't have a life, thank you for informing me. <laughs> it all started back when Sarah wanted to play Red Dead. Yeah, it all started a few, a few years ago when I found out they were making a Red Dead Redemption and I was like, oh hell yeah. Then I went for the midnight release and I was like, oh double hell yeah. And then a few months in, like I played the story about four times and I was like, oh I don't know if I should say hell yeah anymore or hell no because I've got an addiction. Trust me, addiction's yeah. nothing to do with that. I've got one with alcohol and work. Fair enough. Mind you, that might be the fact that I am Scottish, though. Chapter 16 Clash on Big Bridge. So big oh god, I now remember right? this quest now. Okay, I'm gonna stop the second when we I am I'm able to get on this. This is gonna suck. Yeah, because the thing I'm about to do now is the bridge mission. What do you fucking do? Then he came here with the trick the white shock here that you want. Plus, he only won because I'm chatting with him. over there has got to be it. No, that is one big the bridge. Well, you sure can't say it doesn't live up to the name. 
Oh Big God, bridge. That was scary. I almost ran into a fence. What takes Sarah? Oh God, I take huge offense, scary. Sarah. I don't know. Oh, oh, ha ha. Third place. Look at me. No. Me, my Arabian. <laughs> no. Not gonna be fun. Third place. Hell yeah. Still, Here, be cool. we have to Come admire more. it. Who could have built something like this? <laughs> Nobody ever built it. A giant summoned it here in ages past. Oh, Luce dancing. Oh, not that the dance. No, the trash. My job is to look after the bridge. You've come here to cross it, right? Oh, of course you are. Yeah. So, you were saying that the bridge isn't man-made. That oh, someone the, summoned it the here. horse. But, like... The bridge has a real name. Say that for the horse. It's Alexander, in fact. It's not just a horse. It's going to be a superior boy. Big Bridge Alexander. Oh, it's it's the true. How did I miss it? I can sense the bridge is the presence. I look at my up there, third place. This thing is alive. Oh, And that's why a summoner ah. like me has to look after him. Uh, oh wow! So you're a summoner then. Yeah, but it's not like I'm the one that summoned her. <laughs> Fuck. Hey, ah, that's from my face. Hmm? Are you then? You probably the got it by now. The one and only giants from on. the hills? Oh, you bet. Okay. Yeah. That's you hang around with. You, you play with so, this and like, you ain't going to be normal. I guess that means it's true. <laughs> true. Hmm? Wait a second. Yeah. If the prophecy is right. Yeah, it is. You better not even think about it. Like Don't you dare lead us down the wrong path. Huh? Nobody remembers because they're so caught up in the crimson hey. prophecy. Oh. The Azure prophecy, it very clearly says you could bring us salvation or ruin the divergent futures. Oh, that's right. Princess Sarah I did tell us about the divergence. Oh, wait, the what? You're the mean you forgot? I'm starting to worry. Maybe I shouldn't let you use the bridge. Oh no. We're cool. Me and Rain are totally Daddy. going to reap the right future. Sure are. Huh? Don't oh. let at me. Well, it's not like not I can stop lit. you. The prophecy's about you, not, not me, right? Go it's on. Not with you can cross. But no, don't go don't, causing no, the apocalypse. No, 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 Duly no, noted. No, no, it's not. I think you need to say no like six more times, Sarah. Just so, just so everyone's clear. No, 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 and no, shut up. Yeah, 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 That's all my, that's going into the highlights, I'm saving that. Hang on there to we go. your tidy yeah, white chocobos! Huh? Oh, oh, right, so right. ready when you are. This is gonna be fun! No, it this isn't. Isn't. <laughs> no, not Fortnite dance. Can we dance normally? Don't do Fortnite dance. Whoa! Oh, the chicks are dancing. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, rain. I've got a bad picture. What's this? I'm like an, I'm an 80 year old mentally, Shaylee. This is not, I can't keep okay. up with your TikTok and Fortnite dances. I know that you're over there. I suppose you want Me to cross too. the bridge too? Alright, are we gonna throw our heads in the oven? Just throw our heads no. in the oven at the same time? My business Sorry is here off. with you. Summoner. You just cut off from your ear. I watched. An Esper as I thought. Look upon me now. Am I true to your enemy? Are you dancing? Fenrir. I'm so confused. Your place is here by my side. Are you trying to floss? As you wish. But I hope you indulge me with a better She's fight than that well, misdreading with me. Other girl? You mean Rydia? No! What did you do to her? Soon you will no longer care. Come on, speed boy. Oh, how did 
did I, how? How did, how did I fall over? Hmm? Well, there's probably a tree or a twig. There was, there was nothing. Uh, or a twig. Boots. And here I thought gravity was the Come worst on, thing that could happen to us. Come on, let me get a fucking gun. Seriously? Are we there yet? Oh, really? Aww. Did I guess Yeah, I died, I I guess yeah, I died by running into somebody's horse. We have to do the rest of this Can you song. Say something? What? Looks Walk like we have no choice. Why? 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 My nose is itchy. Why hit me? <laughs> I said my nose was itchy, not hit me. Okay, thanks. I'm being abused. My nose is getting hit. That's when you slap. Okay, now I'm gonna get ready to switch over games, so I'll be ready in a second.